What happens to those who died before hearing the gospel? The other options we give to you, the origin and use of the cross, praying for the dead, Christian and circumcision, and you didn't choose any of those. You chose uh, what happens to those who died before hearing the gospel. That's what you chose. And so uh, I'm going to answer that question. Jesus said in John 14, 6, I am the way, the truth, and the light. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Therefore, is there any hope of salvation for those who died before the gospel got to them? Okay. The Bible gives us a clear answer. I want to read it to you. Romans chapter 2. I'm reading from verse 12. For as many as have sinned without law shall also perish without law. And as many as have sinned in the law shall be judged by the law. For not the hearers of the law are just before God, but the doers of the law shall be justified. For when the Gentiles, which have not the law, do by nature the things contained in the law, these having not the law are a law unto themselves, which show the work of the law written in their hearts, their conscience also bearing witness, and their thoughts the meanwhile accusing or else excusing one another, in the day when God shall judge the secrets of men by Jesus Christ according to to my gospel if you didn't get the full understanding of that it's very simple it says those who sinned without law shall be judged without law and those who sinned in the law shall be judged by the law so a man that didn't hear the gospel he says when the Gentiles which have not the law see those who had the law were those the children of Israel who were given the law and so they're going to be judged by the law and those who sinned before the law meaning without the law will be judged without the law according to their conscience and talked about the Gentiles who were not given the law at all and so and haven't uh, heard the gospel so it says when the Gentiles which have not the law do by nature the things contained in the law these having not the law I law unto themselves which are the work of the law written in their hearts there's something we call the golden rule Jesus said do unto others what you will have them do to you it's called a golden rule for a reason. Your conscience can tell whether or not what's been done to you is okay because it's what you did to others. So you want to do to others what you want them to do to you. So your conscience can tell. So he says they will be judged by their conscience. But you see, again, that tells the limits of their rewards, of the glory they get, because it's those who have been separated by the gospel of Jesus Christ that are brought into that glory. Now, others who are brought into the gospel, who lived before the gospel, were those who looked forward to the gospel because they heard of Jesus coming. We're talking about men and women uh, who lived long ago uh, in the days of the prophets, the kings, and so on and so forth, who knew about the promise of the Messiah and they looked forward to the Messiah coming. And now, Messiah has come and um, they have received that message and the Bible says they also will be part of this whole thing maybe I should read something about that to you in the book of Hebrews Hebrews chapter 9 from verse 15 and for this cause he is the mediator of the New Testament that by means of death for the redemption of the transgressions that were under the first testament they which are called might receive the promise of eternal inheritance See? so he says that by means of death for the redemption of the transgressions that were under the first testament so even those who were under the first testament and they were looking forward to the redemption he says they also their sins will be purged See, by means of death the death of Christ even though they lived under the first testament so they also are brought into this eternal inheritance so that's what it is um, for your question what happens to those who died before hearing the gospel so they will be judged according to their conscience and if they were among those who were looking forward to the redemption then the fulfillment has taken place and they'll be blessed by the gospel that they were expecting you said is there any hope of salvation for those who died before the gospel got to them any salvation